Be on this most pleasantly Hello, clear everybody. evening, conditions are absolutely beautiful, perfect for the beautiful game, temperatures are kind as well, no doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level Everyone, of anticipation please, here, surely players. this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods, it surely must be. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. And now, lining up for Nigeria... So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for six. in particular here? Well, this guy, indeed, is someone who has the potential now to start dominating games. And I'm sure in the first 20 minutes or so, he'll be doing that and making his presence felt. With a, a surprisingly good passing range, he really is one of the best at triggering attacks from deeper positions now. Well, quite no argument for me on that one. There's the whistle. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? I'd be hard-pressed, Peter, to find a defensive midfielder better than Wilfred Ndidi. His defensive numbers have been amongst the best in Europe's top leagues, and I just love his, his attitude, his determination, his dedication, and his decision-making. He knows exactly what to do and when. A real unsung hero. Now I'm in front. Chance! This could fall anywhere. Looking for a decent ball in. This could spell danger. And the shot! Oh, that's a fine save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Great corner, and he did the rest. Well, look, it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met, it really was. Number 14, Kelechi Iheanacho! Nigeria ahead, one goal to the good. Aina. South Africa have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Ndidi. Ramirez. Rose. Nigeria are enjoying a good spell right now and leading. Forward it goes. Osimhen! And it's played forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Has gone out. And he's there to cut it out. Ndidi. Nicely measured pass. Goes for goal! It's in! Hot knife through butter. They have done it again.
Oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. The goal score for Nigeria. Number nine. So that's two now without reply. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Lookman, a oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. And they've been caught out here. Going through. Patrick! And for a moment, time stood still. Oh, that was great pressure to force the initial error, Peter. It's the perfect example as to why this is a favourite tactic of a lot of teams these days. Aina. And Didi tries a pass forward. It will be. Iheanacho. Now it's Iheanacho. Iheanacho has a goal! a good finish the odds were against him little matter oh this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score i mean for that defense it was a case of oh you've got him no you don't brilliant number six Nigeria take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. He's off on a maraud. Hits one! Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Ramirez receives it in a good position has a hit it's there and they are right back within touch yeah looking back at that that's how you play on the counter quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish I thought it was a stunning stunning breakaway and he's done it it's a goal Thanks to number 11. So is this the start of a comeback? Trust Kong. Two added minutes. Needed a better pass the there. A 
Really good feet. Iwobi gets it into the middle. And the half-time whistle goes. Well, it's hard to say whether a two-goal advantage under these circumstances is decisive or not, but so far, I haven't really seen enough to indicate that the opposite... Three one situations taking place. So, off we go once more. Oh, good interception. Aina. Iheanacho. Ndidi. Tao gets it back. Osimen. It will be. Right through the middle. This is promising. Osimen! In it goes. And they are pulling clear here. The understanding between those two plays a big part in that, and releasing the run on side proved the key ingredient. Nigeria lost themselves into a three-goal lead. Played in with accuracy. He's made sure that that won't get through. Aina. Ndidi. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Tao drives it forward. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. The attendance for this match played forward. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And the through ball is intercepted. The counter is on. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Substitution for Nigeria. Number 11. Coming on the field. Takes it is out wide. Number 17. Substitution in progress. Big chance! He's kept it out just. South Africa are showing good urgency, but they have to place more emphasis on service into the box. It will be two assists to his credit already. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Yeah, his instinct and the timing of his runs are... Has a pop! It's a class save, he had to be at his best. Osimhen completely showed too much of that to the keeper, and he'll be kicking himself for it. Substitution. But there's going to be another change here. It will be with the short one. Simon. Save to keep that out. It will be who's short. The Queen.
And Didi battles to win it back. A heavy challenge. And the whistle has gone for a reckless challenge there. And that's going to be a booking. Substitution for Nigeria. Number 14. Kelechi Iheanacho! Coming on to replace him is... Mitsu Roby. Number 13. Clears it out of harm's way. Throws the comb. It will be. It's a loose ball. That's a good ball to find him. Danger averted for now. Tries to stroke it through. Good clearance and very necessary. South Africa can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Substitution in progress. Chance! That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Indeed. Will be three minutes at a time. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. McQueen floats one over. Now it's Tao. He's left his man. Good challenge. He just stood firm. And the referee brings it to a close. Nigeria had one big and in style. Everything went for them. Their poor opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Yeah, looking back on this, the early goal had a big influence.